Do you know what today is? Yeah. What is it? Um, my birthday. Your birthday? No, it's Father's Day. No, not Father's Day. <laughs> yes, it is. Happy Father's Day, everybody. For you, happy Father's Day a couple days ago to all the fathers out there. So many times for like Mother's Day and for Father's Day, we can have expectations and if it's not met, then we get upset no, and I'm mad not. and angry. You know what? If you want something done right, you gotta help and you gotta talk about it. I don't know what that is. So <laughs> last night, I'm sleeping. I worked yesterday and he, <laughs> set up his own Father's Day with directions, guys. It is so cute. It says, Happy Father's Day. No. This is pancake no. mix. Add water, warm griddle, make no. pancakes. He crossed off eggs because we don't have any because we don't have much in the house. Don't stress, my Father's Day is perfect because I have you three. Coffee is in the fridge, no. just warm it up. No. <laughs> you want up? Okay, no. I'll help you up. I think that is the cutest and funniest thing. He has no. plates left out. Thank the red you. plate he got out because that's for special days. That's for Mother's Day, for birthdays. Is Daddy going to use this one? Yeah, Daddy's going to use that one. You know why? Because it's Father's Day. This is not the red plate. It's not? No, it's a, it's a gray plate. That is kind of gray. You are so stinking smart. This white plate is mommy's. My fault. Let's so be careful saying that word. Did you guys catch in the vlog the other day Mommy, where Callie you, said it and it was like, some, hmm, my fork. My yes, that is what we call it. My, you want some? Yeah, we're going to put some butter on it too. I want some butter too. Okay. Butter, butter. You want butter, butter? Yeah. Yeah. He's so cute on Mother's Day and made me a sign. I'm stealing that idea. And that's what we're going to make this morning. No, 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 Daddy's sleeping. Shh, 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 shh. Let Daddy sleep. you are to have such a good daddy. Yeah. Do you know so many people would love to have a daddy like yours? Yeah. Mommy? No, I'm gonna hold it. Look at mommy. What do you like to do with daddy? Um, she can't cut on herself. Yeah, but, oh my goodness, Callie. <laughs> oh my goodness, Callie. That is like Kinsley's worst nightmare is to be a mess. This is not what Kinsley would like on her hands. She would come up to me and go, Good job. Whoa! Big one. Mm hmm That's a big pancake. Whoa. Wow. Mom, you gotta do it slow. I gotta do it slow? Yeah. Okay. Daddy can do it too. Daddy can do it too? Yeah. Yeah. Is Daddy really good at making pancakes? Yeah. But, uh, you got it? Nope. Mommy already dropped it off the edge. Okay, that one just is what it is. You got it? Good job, Mom. It's letting me know that. Thank you, sweetie, for saying good job. That was so nice of you. Oh, that's not good either. Happened. Happened? Uh, Mommy okay. made him fall off the edge. Oh. Oh. Okay, do you want to go get Daddy? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Daddy. Daddy's time for pancakes. It's time for pancakes. Do you no. kids even She's love not. Me? You guys need to be nice to Daddy. No. It's Father's Day. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Daddy, can you come? Let's go eat pancakes before they burn. So Daddy is requesting his coffee, which he let me know he already made. He is not high maintenance with coffee. He just needs me to warm it up. Guys, just get out of bed. 
Daddy just got out of bed. I'm so glad I'm your dad. I love you. I love you. Mother. Hi, camera. Does Alex know that you're sideways? <laughs> Very sideways. Happy Father's Day to me. Where did you get this watch? So daddy picked out his own Father's Day present because that's better. You bet Let's be honest. If I pick something out, you'd be like, oh, but there's thanks a story for the shirt. behind it. It's always a story behind okay. it. Okay, the long story short is originally it was 65. He wanted a, sh a watch like this. That wanted that exact watch. And he found it at Kohl's. On clearance. For Thirteen dollars. Friends, Alex just goes, how am I so much better at making pancakes than you? I mean, you ruin them and I make them delicious. It's actually totally true. It's like normal pancakes. I think the thing is you understand timing and science and I just don't. Patience, ooh, that's a virtue. It is an awesome Father's Day and it just started and I just woke up. What I am thinking about this morning is not just that I have the most amazing family in the universe and the most amazing community in the universe. One of the things that I really wanna do this year, I want our organization this year to help other men become fathers. Like, that's my goal. That's what I wanna do more than anything. I remember how I felt before Kinsley and Callie came along. For me, being a dad was always something that I wanted. And we're ready for church, but my favorite moment so far is how Alex was saying, I'm the best pancake maker ever. I'm so much better than you. I forgot I left them on. This is like. They're saucers. They look like um, burger buns. Yeah. Oh my stars. So, Oops. who's the best pancake maker in the house? Hers may be fluffier, but I'm more consistent. <laughs> Happy Father's Day to me. Good Friends, girl. we are at brunch with the family, with Mimi and Papa, Kinsley, Callie, and Alex. And I am enjoying a great, great Father's Day so far. Uh, church was awesome. We're testing our kids because we've been doing the leapfrog videos and just teach our kids how to learn. B. B. What sound does it make? make? What sound does a B make? Thank you, Leapfrog. This is not sponsored. But you can if you want to contact us. You want to have some? Yeah. Okay, you can't have can't my have latte. It. Okay, let's talk about this chai tea latte. It is the best. I'm not a chai best. tea latte person. I'm a black coffee person because chai tea latte is usually too sweet. This is legit the best chai tea latte I've ever had in my life. Whoop, whoop. Okay, can I say this is one of my favorite things of Father's Day? Why does Kinsley love her daddy? Her daddy's job is play. Duh. My favorite thing to do with my dad is play at the park. He has no superhero. Or super, <gasps> he has no superpower. Kinsley, do I have a superhero power? I love dad more than food. Dad always laughs when he eats cereal. Which That's is true. So <laughs> I love my dad because he's funny. Oh, that is so Kinsley, cute. Kinsley, because this is in the YouTube vault, you'll remember this forever and I'll always be able to use this to embarrass you. <laughs> but I never lose the qualities about why you love me. I'm gonna go Callie. Hi, Callie. Thank you for a wonderful Father's Day so far. You get in your bed, please. Callie, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, Callie? Callie? Look at her, she's doing? free climbing. Callie Jo, we're gonna go night night? This is exactly what I wanted for Mother's Day. And then I'm gonna tackle laundry. When it starts spilling out into your bathroom, you know it's time to do laundry. Friends, we all got a nap time, and we have just arrived. We come here, and we play putt-putt at my grandma's retirement community. So we are going to play miniature golf with the entire family to celebrate Father's Day. So I just want to invite you guys, come along. Kinsley, are you going to golf like daddy? Woo, good shot. Kinsley, just give it a big ol' whack. Good job. Can I teach you? Look at the best spectators on earth. You did it! Never, because I expect that. Okay. <laughs> How are you so good? Come on. Hi, guys. Nice. They're having so much fun over there. 
Look at that nice super zoom on that face. The cold sore is going away. Yeah, finally. My dearest father, could you tell me who's winning right now? Uh, I think Rick, your brother-in-law. Rick, we're coming after you. Come get it. We love being able to come out here, don't we, Jessica? Yes. Were you trying to get out of the shot? I saw that. <laughs> Guess what? You're going to be in the teaser. <laughs> that way all the people can't escape your little face. <laughs> Sisterly love. So mean. Oh, you know what else is mean? The poppy seed that's right in your teeth right there. No, we're gonna come down the stairs. So we're at Philip's grandma's house to wrap up Father's Day. She has set up a cute little kitty table and then the adult table. But sometimes you're at houses that are not childproof and the kids wanna get into everything. Don't touch. Are you gonna blow it out? <laughs> are you cleaning? That's so nice and helpful. Oh yeah, I'm sure Mama Mom wants you to clean the floor with her nice little napkins, huh? Okay. No, no, not the floor. Go put it on the table. She made us a very southern meal and it was scrumptious. And now we are eating desserts and celebrating May birthdays, June birthdays, Father's Day, and basically anything else. Happy and it's Father's been awesome. Day, everybody. And happy Father's Day to the best father in the world. Friends, guess what? Jason and Alicia had their baby and we are at their house right now. Alex is so creative and she was like, we have to make a sign. The sign's the most special part coming home with a new baby. And I wanted to tell you guys like some things that were on my heart today. I was grieving um, today all of those that have lost their fathers. I know that there's a lot of you out there that like would have loved to have had a great Father's Day with your dad. I remember all those Father's Days that we were struggling with infertility and those were devastating. And my heart breaks for you because I know how hard Mother's Day, Father's Day was in the midst of our infertility journey. Um, I don't know what it's like to not have a father. Um, I had a great father growing up. Papa was just an amazing father and he set a precedent for me to be strong and dedicated and hardworking and loyal and loving and sacrificial um, and present. And I know that many, 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 many people didn't have the ideal relationship that they wanted to grow up with. And I'm so sorry. If you're one of those that didn't have a great example of a father, if you're one of those who lost your father, if you're one of those who has a good father, but still don't get to spend enough time with him, um, I just want to introduce this topic that God is the greatest father that we could have had. Um, God gave us an example. If you don't have that relationship with your father right now, I just want to encourage you to dig in to where God wants you to be. If you guys are not a part of a local church, I encourage you to go and find one. And if you guys just need some encouragement, I'm here in the comments down below to encourage you. God is a good, good father even if we didn't have the perfect example of a dad. But right now, we're gonna say goodnight to you. Well, you guys, tomorrow we go in for our results that we were talking to you about, the natural doctor that specializes in gut health and also in fertility. So I am very curious on what she's gonna say. I'm not holding my breath, but I'm very curious if naturally she thinks there's something major that we can adjust that could make us conceive naturally. That is a very big question. Which would be awesome this year. But happy Father's Day, everybody. Happy Father's Day. Go let your love multiply. Bye, guys. Bye.